Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. This is Nirav Yadav and in this video we are going to do a price action analysis of Nifty Daily Chart. For the purpose of this video, I am using the platform of investing.com and uh, obviously the daily chart of Nifty 50. So uh, let's just first have a look at the disclaimer uh, in which I clearly state that all views expressed here are for purely educational purpose and if you do any trading or investing using these views then you shall be doing it at your own risk. and. Uh, you will be liable for your profit loss or loss of profit so let's uh, get started with the video and uh, before doing that uh, let's have a the look at the last video i made on the same topic and uh, in this last video we figured out that 7970 was a very important uh, resistance level and before 7970 it was 7590 and uh, these two levels would act as important levels for price movement and let's have a look at Nifty chart right now. So as you can see on screen I have already drawn the levels. Uh, this one is the 7970-8060 level and this is the 7590-7552 level. So uh, these uh, two levels were expected to act as a resistance and we did that video when price was, let's see, when price was at uh, 7472. So we did that video when the price was at this level. So clearly you can see after that uh, price came up till this level of uh, 7590 region and got resistance, crossed the resistance second time. In the second or third attempt it crossed it and as we know from our knowledge of support and resistance that every resistance after being broken acts as support so here you can see it acting as support here once again as support here it was the resistance so after the price broke of it it has acted as uh, this region has acted as support for like two times and uh, after that a good upward movement was there we have seen resistance at the initial boundary line of this region 7579702060 3 times the candle tested this level here and once here 4 times this level has acted as resistance on the daily chart alone or as we can see from the daily chart I should say so right now the uh, view that uh, comes out in mind is that uh, we can have a good upward movement but uh, i think a correction is due so where can a correction come up to so we will obviously look at the support regions that are established previously and that are established right now to have a view of where can the correction come up to so obviously this 7590 region is a previously established support and if the price has to give a pullback it can come till this region but a new level which has, which has been established is this uh, 7750 uh, to say what uh, 7722 let me uh, draw them correctly with perfect spacing so it will come down to I think uh, yeah it should come down to this 7720 and 7760 region which would also cover this gap 7720 to 7760 so this is the new resistance oh sorry support level established over here if we move to the left on the chart we can see that this level also act as a support previously and we are expecting it to act as resistance this time and also if we look further back this act as a support also previously also so two times it has acted as support previously and uh, we can expect a price to come up till this level of 7720 to 7760 give a pullback at least till this region and then uh, make an upward movement if price obviously breaks this important level of 8060 then a bigger upward move is in the making and obviously we'll look at the next uh, resistance levels uh, which will come around this level of 8300 and plus levels so the next uh, target uh, if the price breaks this important resistance level would be in this 
region of 8300 plus and that is the discussion based on support and resistance levels and uh, let me just conclude what we saw in this video so we saw that this level of 7970 to 8060 as we discussed previously or in our previous video has acted as a very strong resistance also this level which we predicted could act as a resistance did not act as a very strong resistance actually was tested like two times here and then after it bro price broke above it it acted as a support so this can now act as a support uh, region if the price comes to give a pullback up till this region of uh, 7590 to 7550 and obviously if the uptrend is to continue then the possible targets after this break of 8060 would be 8300 plus levels and all this discussion is based on the concept of support and resistance only you can uh, view my video on support and resistance i will provide the link in the description and that is all i want to discuss in this video and one more thing i want to yeah, tell you guys is that i'm working on my website and uh, it can take like one or two months i will provide more uh, informative stuff on the website other than that you can connect with me via facebook twitter or google plus and thanks for watching